Good morning, everyone. Welcome to a new week. So, didn't sleep super great last night. Went to bed really late and got up relatively on time, but a lot of tossing and turning. So, let's get in there and see how things went. I know we have all those nights where sometimes we just don't feel great going through it. Yep. So, still above 80, which is good, but not really getting the full complete rest that you're expecting. Yep, and that tracks a lot of the end of that night was a lot of tossing and turning, so that's a lot of dozing sleep instead of, you know, some really good snoozing or slumbering. 22 minutes to get to sleep and to take a while. Alright, some type sleep. Cool. Nice. Ooh. Quite. <laughs> Great way to then end, end out the week. Aww. We got Sphio on top. Marowak. And looks like we got a Magnemite and Totodile. Weekly buff. We got Larvitar out there stretching out. Wartoril! Very happy to see that. All right, let's get through our repeats. Oof. So I think we just got the two new entries. Mm -hmm. Scratchy bone sleep. When observing it, clutching its bone even in its sleep, you sometimes see Marowak sleeping when its bone is a pillow. Perhaps this means Pokemon makes it feel at ease. That's cute. And feel a <laughs> top belly sleep. You know, just getting on top of Snorlax and it's just a big, comfy, cushy pillow. Ooh, and this feel sleep style decks is almost filled out. That's great. Okay. And just like yesterday, snack time is going to be <clears throat> really short. Because it's really just only going to be the premium biscuit. And then War Turtle's got a while to go. I think the only one that really to fill in that use feel. Oh, yeah, the Inkly Buff's hungry, and I can instantly get it. They haven't. Oh, it's doing that thing again. I'm not trying to tap on you, but you're. There we go. Seems like the top left corner seems to be stuck. Try to tap in there. It's an instant recruit because it's hungry, so we're just gonna go with that. If I had a couple more, I might try for this feel just to try to get that. It's also a good, uh, good Pokemon for collecting resources. All right, that's where we're gonna leave snack time for today. Thanks, Professor Doroli. And I'm going to leave that as the photo for today, because it's just an absolute cutie patootie.
Yeah, it looks like we'll be getting another rank up in the next day or so. Alright, a relaxed nature. A chipberry, honey. Oh, it's the restore energy to the team. Ooh. Skill level up S. Alright, so it restores more energy. That's good for the low energy days. Extra research XP triggers more often. It is requiring you to get at that uh, level 50. That is going to take a while. That's okay. Good to have. Alright. We'll collect our sleep points. Back to our normal values now that we're outside of the event. And that's it for our week. We're gonna choose our next research site and collect some berries, feed breakfast, and get the day off, get the, the week started off right. Bump up that research by 5%. So, right now, since I've been doing it the entire time in Greengrass Isle, it's giving me maximum bonus, which helps to get that higher sleep score, help find some of the stuff. It's been a little bit more difficult to see. But for now, it's time to say bye to our Snorlax friend. Thanks for a great week. Oh. <laughs> this is our seventh week in the game. Reached Master Rank 4, which is the highest and my highest pull from berries and from cooking, or at least an improvement from last week, which is good. And still an overall grade of S, so some handy candy, which will help out in leveling up some Pokemon. Give me a nice, even, consistent sleep duration and time. It's really only the last two days that uh, really fell off the wagon, so to speak. So, as you can see here, because we don't see the screen often, I've got access to Top Hollow, as well as Cyan Beach, and the uh, Snow Tundra is not accessible to me until I get another 10 styles. But I'm going to keep trucking on Greengrass Isle, just because I'm getting that nice sweet bonus on there. There's still a lot more to be found. There's a lot of sleep styles in there that have Pokemon movies that I've seen, but sleep styles that I haven't seen them in. And the only way to do that is with the higher drowsy power, so just gotta kind of keep at it. This also means that today is also the day that my good camp ticket runs out, so it's just going to be kind of just a normal vanilla week. Ooh boy, I don't know that I have a lot of Pokemon that love for those berries, they collect them. Hmm. This will be a fun, challenging week. Some recovery incense, wonderful. But we definitely want to make sure that we're collecting the berries before changing the team up. breakfast. I'm going to do a little bit of a team change up. And I want to try a new Pokemon that you know, actually, this will probably be easier from the box menu. If we use the little fly glass down in the bottom, we can go down beyond berries to just Snorlax's favorites. So I can see that I've only really got three that actually are going to benefit from 
being able to get Snorlax's favorite. And none of them are ones that I'm particularly working on for any sort of progression. So this is going to be a very low berry favorite score getting boosted week. So we'll switch it over to the ingredient gathering group. And then the only other one adjustment that I need to make is just because I'm working on the progression, so it's one that I actually need to make a change to. But I'm going to be adding an Eevee. And that is... Yeah, I've only got the two, so no, that'll be that level six one. Just as I'm trying to get more time with it so I can get one of the evolutions. Alright. So then I guess the only other thing that I would want to do before cooking... Oh no, I do have a level 13. I'm being silly. There it is. Go an entire week without double checking that. Because really, this is the only time that I really look into doing any adjustments on the team stuff. Alright, and it's already past level 10, so I don't have to do any leveling there. So. Check. We don't have any news today. Great. And 30 water types and 15 rock types. Cool. So some extra premium currency and an energy pillow. Let's check in with our friends and see how they've been doing. Alright. And we're getting I'm starting to get my rank 3 ups. And if you didn't know, linking cords right here rank up. So if you need help getting some of those evolutions that require it, you'll get naturally get some through just leveling up your friends. Okay. We got the squad set up. Let's get cooking. Thankfully now, uh, it's just, oh, good camps that I guess lasts until exactly when I used it, so I've got it for the morning, but I only got 18 ingredients, so I'm not going to be able to max that out. A nice mix salad to start the day off isn't too bad. Actually, we got some fruit in there. Not that I've ever really had fruit, or uh, never had salad for breakfast. to each their own. Look how small Snorlax is. We're gonna get that nice and big this week. Hopefully by the end of the day we should be through all of the basic levels, so check back tomorrow and we'll see how I've been doing. Alright, I think that's going to do it for me today. Thanks so much for stopping by. How's your experience been from the last week from the event? Let me know in the comments below. For now, sleep well. Bye.